So, first we will be talking about the nasal septum. So, when we talk about the nasal septum, we should know what are the components which make up the nasal septum. Even though we say that uh, the nasal septum is lying uh, in the middle of the nasal cavity, it is not actually dividing the nasal cavity into two equal halves. It is not a single straight line. It is just having a deviation to right or left depending. So, the nasal septum is made up of bony part and a cartilaginous part. So, when we talk about the nasal septum, we should think about the bony part as well as the cartilaginous part. So, this is the roof, this is the floor and in between you have the nasal septum. So, when we talk about the nasal septum, we can just draw an oblique line and one line anteriorly. So, that we will get roughly three quadrants. This is called the anterior part, this is anterior, this is postero superior and this one is postero inferior. So, this is anterior part, this is postero superior part and this is postero inferior part. So, this is how we are going to describe the nasal septum. So, when we talk about the nasal septum, it, the entire thing is not made up of bone. The postero superior and postero inferior is having a bony origin whereas, the anterior part is made up of cartilage. So, which are the bones forming the nasal septum? The, the first one is the ethmoid bone. In the postero superior quadrant, the perpendicular plate of ethmoid bone will be forming the nasal septum in the postero superior part and the vomer. Vomer will be forming or will be contributing to the formation of postero inferior part of nasal septum. So, these two quadrants are formed by the bones, ethmoid bone and vomer and the anterior part alone is made up of cartilage. So, which is the cartilage seen in the nasal septum in the anterior aspect? It is the septal cartilage. So, septal cartilage is actually seen in the anterior aspect along with the ala cartilage. Ala cartilage, a part of ala cartilage also will be contributing to the formation of the cartilaginous part of nasal septum. So, the subheading under which you are going to describe the nasal septum will be the parts contributing to the formation of nasal septum. So, you can broadly divide it as two parts, one is the bony part and one is the cartilaginous part and now you are going to divide the nasal septum into three quadrants, anterior part, postero superior part, postero inferior part. Anterior part is cartilaginous which is made up of septal cartilage and ala cartilage. Postero superior part, part is made up of ethmoid, postero inferior part is made up of vomer. So, that is how nasal septum is formed.